man, it's your boy Snack King Colin. I am here. You know the rest? Cause I'm hungry. So your boy did what no man has gone before. I went to Burger King for not no Whopper, no chicken fries, no Mac and Cheetos. I went for tacos. Mm. Went up here at Burger King. Let me tell you about my experience here at Burger King real quick. <laughs> Hey, the best nation is donation, baby. So I went to uh, Burger King, ordered my food. First of all, I went to the door. Understaffed. We closed the lobby early. What? 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 Bad experience already. Hop back in the car. I'm like, let's try the drive-thru. Go to the drive-thru. Can I help you? Can I get two tacos, please? Come to the second window. Oh, heck no. Roll up my sleeves. We about to get all adultish. I'm about to yelp about you real quick. Let me go to the second window and let me give her a piece of my mind. She comes to the window, she's like, here you go, take those. Just like, take them? Like you don't need no money or nothing? She said, just take them. Ah, shoot up to five star. Birkin usually got a five star. Anyway, so <laughs> these free tacos, I don't even know how they could taste bad. Hopefully they didn't fall on the floor or something like that. I don't know what's going on with that Burger King. So we're about to dive into this. Now, I did not get any kind of taco sauce. I looked all over this hotel. There's not a taco sauce packet anywhere. I'm not going to complain about no taco sauce when I got free tacos. Come on, baby. That's what the Anglo-Saxons do. Not your boy. Who's just thankful I ain't have to pull out this $3. You know what I mean? But they are a dollar a piece if you don't get a cool lady like me on it, man. Uh... So I got them. Taco, taco. Did I just drool a little bit? That was disgusting. So we're about to dive right into this bad boy. It don't look bad, though. It don't look bad. You see it got the lettuce. It got the cheese. Nothing's melted. Um, and it got some meat. Oh, my God. That looks kind of actually horrible right there. Whew. Looks like the bottom of a pan. Like, when you make... When you make actual tacos and you got the bottom of the pan because you didn't put no no stick on there, that's what that looks like. <sighs> what am I doing with my life? I got two tacos because I figured I cannot just take one taco to the face and be okay with it. And give you an actual judgment. So I got two tacos. We're going to do both these tacos right now. So I'm going to dive into this. Now this is nice. Like Jack in the Box. I like Jack in the Box tacos after a couple of <laughs> <No, they ain't. laughs> Them Jack in the Box tacos is cracking. And they're also two for a dollar instead of a dollar each. But this is a nice crispy shell. Uh, it is kind of, you know what I mean, a little, little extra <laughs> gooey right here. But... That's that's on that. I'm not looking for Taco Bell. I'm not looking for Taco Del. Mar. I'm not looking for authentic nothing. It's Burger King, baby. But we're gonna go ahead and dive right into this, man. Oh my God, this this meat, whatever this mystery meat in here looks bad. Look at that. Can you guys focus? Can we focus, please? Oh my God, gracious. <laughs> Let's go. Let's do it.
think about it like this. For people in my generation, kids, you probably won't understand this. The kids that watch this show, you probably won't understand this. Because because your parents are my are, are from my generation, and, and I don't give my kids this crap either. Imagine Taco Bell being grandma's mashed potatoes. This is kids' cuisine mashed potatoes. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Burger King, baby! Burger King, focus on me. Focus, focus. Burger King, listen to your guala. Please stick with the Whoppers. <coughs> what is that spice? That's like, that's like knuckle ash in my mouth right now. Like, what is that different? That's a different spice right there. Where do you get that from? Like, I've never tasted that before. <sighs> Listen, stick to your burgers. They're amazing. Okay? Your croissant sandwiches, oh, oh, to die for it. I wish there was a Burger King closer to me than this McDonald's. No offense, McDonald's. I'm tired of having you. These tacos, though, baby. You got Jack in the Box seeming like, God, uh, seeming like they just... They just, uh, what's a Mexican name for Jack? <laughs> like, they're just an authentic Mexican food, man. I don't know what that meat is. That meat is really mystery meat. I feel like you just took a cow, extra parts, and put it in a blender. And was like, let's make, oh, you know what we can do with this extra ground beef we got? Let's just go ahead and make some tacos. Remember we used to do that back in the day? I never had the first batch. And I'll never have these again. I did it. I came, I saw, I conquered. And since it was free, I don't even feel like I have to eat this other one. And I probably won't. I'm actually gonna go offer it to my coworker, who's a Mexican, so she's probably not gonna eat this at all. Come on, Burger King. Stick to what you know, baby. Quit trying to go out the quit trying to go out the rim. Nobody wants a taco from Burger King. I've never been like, man. I've never been in the Burger King line. It was just like, I just don't know what I want. I just want a taco. Like, why don't they? Nobody's ever said that. I promise you. And nobody's ever going to say that. If you have somebody coming to get these back to back to back, there's probably like five people in America that like these tacos. Give them the recipe and write it off in the books, baby. No more tacos at Burger King. You get with free tacos, by the way. And I love free stuff. You're getting a zero. I don't want these no more. These, these are nasty. These are disgusting. These are disgusting. These are just these are nasty, disgusting nastiness. I don't even know. I have to make up a new word for the way these tacos taste. I'm hungry too. I all all I do is eat, and I'm not eating this other taco. Bird King, stick to what you know, baby. It's caught in the crossfire